Hello everyone and welcome back. It's Hannah here from Singing Hin. I'm a singing teacher and I also teach guitar and ukulele and I play Northumbrian pipes and various other odds and sods as a professional musician. So we've been looking at different things through the year, picking up different themes and this month it's all about listening month and so I thought that's a really really good one because I find a lot of people listen to music but they don't necessarily always hear music so we're going to take the month to have a look at the differences and how that works with music let's dive right in so the difference between listening and hearing then if you think that hearing something is very passive it's involuntary it's very much a sensory process you have ears and as long as they work you will hear things whether you necessarily want to or not so right now while i'm talking to you i can hear other things going on i can hear a car going past and there's a car pulled up as well hopefully though you can't hear that but I can hear those things, but I can choose to just ignore them and they, they, they have no impact on me. But my ear is, is involuntarily hearing it. And that requires no real effort. However, listening can be seen as a totally different thing. Listening can be seen as a very active, a very voluntary uh, activity and an intentional process. When you listen, you are turning your focus, you are turning your attention onto the sound. And because of that, you will develop an emotional response potentially to that. But it's very much active. You have to be paying attention. And that is super, super important, not just in life. And I'm sure you've be, there's been times when you've been hearing a conversation that you're meant to be part of, but you weren't necessarily listening. You were potentially off thinking about what you're doing next or you're looking at the text that's just come through. And so listening is a, a, a really good habit to try to embrace if you don't really do it and giving somebody your full attention and I will put my hand up here right now I am not the best at that my brain is like Ooh, off 20 to the dozen so actually trying to pull it back and just focus and listen to one person entirely to what they're saying and not let my mind buzz off in 17 other directions I find very difficult but that doesn't mean it's not a good habit to try to form but this can be taken a step further into music and that idea of when did you actually stop, sit down and listen to a piece of music? Quite often you might have the radio or music on in the background and you are hearing it and you will be singing along to it and enjoying it for that purpose. But when have you sat down and listened entirely to a piece of music and to what is going on within it? And that is what we're going to start doing in the following weeks so stay tuned hit that like button subscribe and i'll see you next time until then take care